Hey guys, this is uh, part two of the Tux paint demo with the G-Stick. Um, the first part I recorded and then my camera battery died. So I'm going to uh, finish this, uh, this quick little picture here with the G-Stick. I'm going to put a tree in. I was, oh that's the squirrel. I was uh, coloring this that's still a squirrel. <laughs> I have to select the proper tool over here. Actually, is what I'm doing wrong. I'll color over the squirrel. We downloaded this program yesterday for my daughter and she she must have sat here for two hours drawing and painting and the program is really great for kids and I'm telling you about it because it's free and that's what's amazing uh, so I'm gonna change color to brown and draw a little some tree trunks And then we will add some. So they have a selection tool here. I have some leaves. So I can add some leaves to the tree. The clicking sound is just me clicking the mouse to, to tell it to paint. I think that one of the great things about the G-Stick is you can go from painting in a program like this to just uh, everyday uses like searching Google or Bing or going on Facebook or going to eBay and, and then right back into Photoshop. So all with the same mouse. Um, so there's some leaves. We'll make it a little thicker. And we'll add a couple of squirrels running around a tree. And then they have an option over here. You can go over here to a magic wand and then add some flowers. Actually, I'm going to add some grass first. So I'm going to click down here and I found some grass. And we'll add some grass. It looks like I just covered the squirrels in grass. And we'll add a couple of flowers. So there we go. There's a, a little tree and some grass and uh, things. All right, thanks for watching the uh, G Stick demo with Tux Paint. Again, Tux Paint is completely free for kids or anybody can download it, but it was actually designed for kids uh, by teachers. Thanks so much. S see you next time.